we are here at House of Cars in Myrtle Beach. About to go check it out. Hey, what's up everyone? Finally made it here at the House of Cars in uh, South Carolina, Myrtle Beach. And, what? Look at all this. I don't even know where to start. So, you guys are coming along for the ride. And they got some stuff that from, these are like from the 90s. Oh, that's dope. Go check that out. It's a lot of good stuff. I've got one of these in the tournament. This uh, designer Desmond Hulk is uh, racing one of those. Got one of these. I'm gonna be honest, I'm gonna do some looking around because um, there's a lot of stuff here, but I will take some more pictures and I'll show you what I got when I get out of here. Okay, so I just checked out here with uh, Adam and um, at the famous House of Cars in Myrtle Beach and I'll show you what I got when I get back. Thanks, Adam. Hey, what's up everyone? Ken Savage, JD3. I am back again from my excursion uh, at House of Cars in Myrtle Beach and um, I told you guys I was going to show you what I got when I got back, so um, here we are. I'm going to turn the camera around so you can get a better shot of that this um, I don't know it just stood out to me something about this thing like one it's old school man I love I love old school stuff and you know I don't really not that I don't see a lot of it around my way I can I can get a hold of it it's just that you know it's not out in in stores you know you have to actually look for it so going to house of cars and they actually had these on the rack on the pegs um, along with um you know newer stuff like the newer stuff that's out now that was pretty cool and i mean the, the price wasn't bad and this is called the um the miss t suzuka and you know what's funny i actually have one i didn't know that this this um car went that far back into the i think this is the 90s this gotta be 90s I, let me see what's the uh hmm where can i see it should say somewhere on the back like what what year this is 2003 let's see if I can show that to you guys 2003 Mattel so I mean this is pretty old and I didn't know that the Misty Suzuka went back that far because I actually have this in the newer version which is more like manga out it's like they got the manga um you know stuff on it this I saw and I was just like wow this is um you know pretty different I haven't seen anything like it and um, so yeah, I got it. Pretty cool, it's called the Triumph TR6. Let's see, what year did this come out? 2020, so it wasn't too long ago. Okay. Um, this is um, the Tantrum. This is called the Tantrum. Pretty dope. I like how they chromed out the insides. The wheels look pretty cool. Tails chromed out, and I also like the fact that they did the, the grill too. The inside. That was dope. So, yeah. Not bad for 175. This was, um, this, I mean, I don't know. <laughs> 
I was like, man, this thing is awesome. It's a Volkswagen. It's a Beetle, but they uh, modified the body. It kind of looks like a Speedtail, right? It reminds me of a Porsche Speedtail. Hmm. I said Porsche. McLaren. That's what I meant to say. Um... I, I don't know, man. I just like it. It looks cool. This is really awesome. Uh, 250 for that one. Not bad. This one is dated for 2021. I haven't. I just recently started collecting like hard again because you know I always had them, but really going at it. I mean, it's only been like a year, maybe two years. So a lot of these from 2020 and back I'm you know this I had to get this Nissan Fair Lady Z like who doesn't love a fair lady alright this one's dated for 2015 and um for three bucks I mean it's not bad at all I like I like what else what else I got this for my son I've been trying to find him a Spider-Man uh he likes Spider-Man stuff so I got this for him. Looks pretty cool. Um, this man, I haven't seen anything like this before. This I had to get. It's just like something about it, man. You know, it reminds me of. Um, they have something now. I can't remember the name of it. There's. It's called a. It's called a speedster or something like that. I remember. I don't know who makes it. I don't know who the. Uh, Oh man, I wish I could remember like the exact name of it. When I find it, I'm gonna take a picture of that car and this car and the similarities because they both have that that twin cockpit feel. Oh man, I wish I could remember. It was I think it's McLaren, but it, it's probably not. It's probably something else. But um, I just like the way this looks. It's like a, it's like classic meets future. I like it. It's pretty cool. This is dated back for um. This is called the Extremester. And it is dated back to 2003. Another, another nice little classic there. That's awesome. Um, this was probably the priciest of them all. The uh, 1985 Honda CRX. I haven't seen this like design before, so I ha I picked it up. Um, pretty cool. The, the um, packaging doesn't look old, so I'm guessing it's not that old. Let's take a look and see. 2020. So, uh, yeah. It's not that old, but man, I like, I like that. That's really cool. And last but not least, this Audi RS2. I think it's nice. So, that's what I got. And, um, uh, Thanks for coming along with me on my uh, my first trip ever to um, to um, House of Cars. Um, everybody was cool there. They had a lot of stuff there. I recommend you go there. Check it out. And uh, that's all I got for you guys.